Short-term inflation measured by the Sensitive Price Index or SPI continues to rise due to increasing petroleum prices according to official data released on Friday. SPI-based inflation went up by 24% year-on-year for the week ending on July 18th with a weekly rise of just under 1%. This marks seven consecutive months of rising SPI-based inflation. The Finance Act of 2024, which introduced several indirect taxes from July 1st, has contributed to inflation increases, especially affecting prices for pharmaceuticals, stationery, and poultry products. Additionally, higher sales tax and customs duty on fresh vegetables and fruit imports from Iran and Afghanistan have driven up food inflation. Weekly inflation is a record of over 48% year-on-year in early May 2023 then dropped to about 24% in late August and surged past 40% by mid-November. Items with the highest week-on-week price increases including chicken, powdered milk, petrol, eggs, and diesel and garlic. Conversely, prices of tomatoes, bananas, onions, pulse masoor, and LPG decreased. On an annual basis, significant price increases were seen in gas charges for the first quarter, onions, tomatoes, powdered milk, pulse gram, garlic, chili powder, pulse mong, men's sandals, shirts, salt, LPG, pulse mash, beef, and electricity charges for the first quarter. In contrast, prices of wheat flour, cooking oil, vegetable ghee, mustard oil, eggs, rice, basmati, broken, and Lipton tea dropped. The SPI stood at 321.4, up from 318.96 in the previous week, and 458.45 from a year ago. The index, comprising of 51 items from 50 markets in 17 cities, is computed weekly to assess essential commodity and service prices at shorter intervals. Data showed price increases for 29 items, decreases for 5 items, and stability for 17 items compared to the previous week.